So Olivia, I'm so excited to chat with you today about Cruel Summer. What can you tease about this series? This series is so fun. It's so unique and so special. I've never been a part of a project like this before, nor have I seen in television something like this before. And I love that it's just so female driven and told from the perspectives of two female girls and young teenage girls who are trying to figure out who they are in this weird time. And I think um, there's just something that's so interesting about every aspect of this show and every character. And I'm really excited for people to see it. Speaking of female driven, one of the executive producers is Jessica Beal. What can you tell us about what it was like working with her on this project? Jessica is an incredible human being. Um, and I don't say that, like, like she is so special and so such a leader. and to be able to work with somebody who's been in this business for such a long time in front of the camera, but really has really has a, 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 a niche for being behind the camera and being so involved is something that I haven't really experienced before um, on this level. And she was very involved in the way that she led this show and the way that she communicated with her co-workers and her cast was just beyond and I'm so grateful to know her and to work with her. And were there any fun like tidbits or moments that you had with her when the cameras weren't rolling? Jessica just made herself like her presence was just even if she wasn't necessarily with us through the entire duration of filming season one her presence was always there and I think that's something that people should really know about her and she's just so fun and so creative and um, just her energy altogether is really special. The fashion in this series is really amazing. It's totally 90s vibes. Is there any outfits that you wanted to take home from set or did you draw any inspiration from your looks? Um, I wanted to take all of them. <laughs> and it's fun too, because we should, we should be able to have fun with our style and with 90s fashion, especially there's so many different and specific looks in that era. And so, I was so excited that I had these three different years to play with because Kate has a very different wardrobe in each year, but all of them, I mean, I wanted to take every single outfit. I love them so, so much. Um, 95 Kate, where she's in the grunge stage is probably my favorite. And I did take a few outfits cause I was obsessed, but yeah, some really great fashion in this show.